Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Hero, and I'm here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the end of July. You're going to catch me with messy hair. I'm in between stages, and is what it is. I really don't care. So anyway, this is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the end of July. What do we have for Leo? Well, we got two that fell out. I think we'll just take those. Hills. Obstacles to overcome. So when you see hills, when you get a card that has hills on it, there's challenges, okay? But you can overcome them. So you may be dealing with some challenges. Ooh, wreath. Sorrow over a loss. So... There's some sort of sorrow over a loss. This is an obstacle, obviously, that you need to overcome. So you're going to be overcoming some sort of loss. Could be anything. Could be anything. You're going to obviously be in your feelings about this loss. And it's going to be a challenge to overcome it. So what do we have for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Drama Queen. So we have a Drama Queen here. Spring. Spring is prominent. Let's get another card. You're gonna you're gonna reach your by and I know this is maybe this started in spring. Maybe this is when it started. Maybe you're at the peak right now and things start to get better. I don't know. Um, but if not, by next spring you'll be over it. <laughs> I know that's a long time because we just had spring, but we'll see. Ooh, speeding causes accidents. So there's a need to slow down. There is a need to slow down. Maybe something started in spring. Now spring is April, May, June. Spring, I think spring is part of March, April, May, and part of June. So there's something you have probably sped into or you're speeding into right now. You absolutely positively need to slow down because... And people automatically, when they see that card, they think of it as a vehicle. Yeah, it could be, but it could also be in other areas of your life. You know, it could be cutting things too fast and you cut your finger. It could be running and you trip and fall. Speeding causes accidents. You need to slow down. Some of you are dealing with a skilled player, so I suggest that you beware. Um... somebody is playing with you you may not maybe you're moving so fast that you don't even see it so I think that you need to beware I do think that you need to beware there's an obstacle to be overcome some obviously when you're dealing with a skilled player somebody is not showing you all their cards okay so there's there's something that you are not aware of that you need to be aware of and obviously it's hidden and it's hidden very well somebody's got on a poker face Okay, so beware. Be very, very aware. Um, I also, you know, I for some of you, I mean, the drama queen could be you, but I, what I wanted to say is that I don't think it's you. I think that it is somebody else. I think that there is somebody here that is going to be causing you some drama. Okay? I think that this person is connected to the skilled player. All right? This person may be born in the spring, March, April, May, part of June, or something started in the spring. So spring is prominent. What do we have for Leo? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. There is an obstacle to be overcome. You're going to be facing some challenges. Okay? Maybe you're feeling dramatic, and that's a normal feeling. Okay? Over a loss. All right? Um, oh... You know, it could be you, and don't don't get. I mean, even if you do get triggered, sometimes you have to be okay. The Queen of Wands is Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. That is a drama queen. Okay, so you may need to master your emotions, but you could also be dealing with somebody that is very angry. You could be angry. You could be upset. You could be having a hard time. Um, this is feeling weak, lack of confidence, lack of willpower. Maybe even 
uh, a lack of determination, lack of ambition, lack of drive, or you're just really, really angry and upset and you need to control yourself. The Queen of Wands in reverse sometimes cannot control themselves, so you may need to control your temper. Um, there could be an imbalance here. There could be some health. Maybe you need to focus on your health. You need to focus on yourself. Five of Pentacles. Eight of Wands, or Eight of Swords reversed. Queen of Cups reversed. That is your drama queen, and that's what I really think. I think that you are dealing with a, a water sign. And I, when I, the minute the drama queen card came out, I thought of the Queen of Cups instantly, instantly. So I feel like for some of you, you're dealing with a water sign or somebody that cannot master their emotions, and they are going to pick a fight with you. Uh, I think that neither one of you are in a good headspace, okay, both in reversed. Um, Ten of Wands, we have some, this Queen of Cups is, is overwhelmed. Page of Cups, now it could be a male or a female. Ten of Cups reversed, this has to do with a relationship. Nine of Wands reversed. And the Lovers, last card out, unexpected choice in love. This is about... A partnership it is about love it is very very emotional it is a flood of emotion you are going to be in your emotions at the end of the month this has to do with a partnership it has to do with a union perhaps even a soulmate partnership or a soulmate union with the lovers card I feel as though you have somebody around you that is jealous they are vindictive, they are revengeful, manipulative, and they are going to poke you in some way. They're going to poke you. They are, maybe they're in an unhappy relationship. They're unhappy about a separation. They're unhappy about, um, I don't know, they're unhappy about, a breakup something about a breakup it feels like there's another woman here there's another woman we have two women here by the way so there's a there's a relationship that is not on the same page and it's two it's two women fighting there there's two women here that are going to be uh, it's almost like fighting for somebody or fighting for a relationship which is interesting I do see abandonment, I see ghosting, I see neglect, I, I, I see begging, begging for attention, begging for help. Somebody is begging, it's like they're begging, they, they, they are overwhelmed, they're overwhelmed, they're holding on to something that they need to let go of. The Ten of, ten of Wands is right in the middle. This is, this is carrying, carrying a heavy burden, carrying it, not wanting to let it go. I think that you have somebody around you that does either they don't want to let you go or they don't, they don't want to let go of their partner. It could be an ex. Um, extremely overwhelmed, trying to do too much, too many responsibilities, unable to master emotions, expect some serious challenges. We have nine of wands reversed. That is angry, angry over everything that has happened. It's having a hard time finding the strength to deal with all these challenges. I feel like you are going to be dealing with some serious challenges this month at the end of the month. And one of them has to do with another person that it, that is all over the place. This person is very wishy-washy. They are emotionally... Um, I don't know if they're hysterical, they throw fits, they throw tantrums, they uh, use emotional blackmail as a tool. There is somebody in your reading that is, um, this could be a crybaby, I mean I hate to say those words, they cry to get their way. Um, excuse me. It's interesting because when you cry you usually sniffle. Anyway. Um, so you may be even be in your tears. I feel like there is somebody here that is, if you, especially if you are a female, there is a female here that is extremely emotional and she cannot master her emotions and she may throw a fit. She may throw a tantrum, whether it's you or another female. There's definitely two females here and it feels like they're fighting over a relationship. And I feel like this is like a dying dream. It is... Uh, 
I don't know if it has to do with children with the Ten of Cups reverse. Could be children leaving home, fighting over the children or something like that. It feels like you have somebody here that is not very kind. They're not very gentle. They're not very giving. This is somebody that wants power. They want control. Um, it may be because of money. They don't want to give money because there's financial hardship here with the Five of Pentacles. Somebody may be holding on to something or they want something just for the money. They don't want to give the money, okay? They don't want to give the money, okay? There is somebody here that is wanting to hold on to something just for the money um, with that Five of Pentacles. There's some sort of financial hardship here, Um so be prepared to deal with some challenges. You will be dealing with some challenges this month. Um, you need to protect yourself. You need to, uh, I think that you, you may have your guard up to what's going to happen next. What is this person going to do next? And I feel like you are right to feel that way because I feel like you're dealing, it almost feels like you're dealing with somebody who is crazy. You know, this person is, and I, I'm not trying to scare anybody, but this person is uh, very manipulative, extremely manipulative. Um, Eight of Swords reverse in the future, an obstacle being removed. There is an obstacle being removed. We have somebody here that is lying. They are lying. They, are, they have probably been getting away with it, but I feel like there, I don't know if there's a child involved that is going to be just, you know, spilling the beans or expressing their feelings from their heart. Um, there is a new connection, or if it's not a child, it is somebody that is following their heart. Somebody is going to be following their heart. And I feel like they're following their heart in a new direction towards a partnership that is very divinely guided, okay? There is love here. This is following the heart. We have a divinely guided new start in love or a reconciliation or, you know, things getting better. This is a healing love, a healing energy. I feel like um, there's going to be an expression of feelings right above that lover's card is the page of cups. It's good news. It's it's following the heart. There There's somebody here that you may be dealing with a Gemini. You could also be dealing with a P Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um, we have somebody here that is working too much. They're trying too hard. They they are got a lot of responsibilities. They may be in a situation that they are afraid of another person. They may be afraid to leave. They may be afraid to step forward. But they, I feel like they're going to, which is interesting. There's definitely, with that Nine of Wands reversed, it's like they may even feel inadequate. They may feel in, ad, inadequate because they were dealing with somebody that emotionally blackmailed them or told them that they weren't good enough, that nobody would want them. There is somebody here in this reading that has been neglected, that has been told that they are not good enough by an individual that uses emotional manipulation on them. This person um, has reached rock bottom, and I feel like this person wants to remove themselves from a situation that they have been trapped in, but they haven't been able to remove themselves because of this vindictive person who, I don't know if they're crazy, because I, I want to keep saying crazy, um, but they're not in a, ha un, in a happy relationship. So we do have so, an unhappy relationship here with the Ten of Cups reversed. There's another woman here that is going to be causing you some problems. I don't know if you're male or female. If you're watching this, there is a woman here that is going to be causing you some problems. This person is um, the drama queen. This person is the drama queen. Um, you can expect a challenge, okay? You will, you are going to be challenged. You're going to be challenged. This person is challenging you because it's almost like they don't want to lose the stability. They don't want to lose the money. So be prepared. Be prepared for that. I don't know if this has to do with child support or has to do with a relationship or, you know, a partner that is with somebody just for the money. This has, to, it definitely has to do with money, okay? And I think there is some overwhelming money problems here. I feel like there is some money problems here, but I feel like uh, 
help is arriving maybe there's some unexpected help arriving somebody is 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 feeling you you know they're crushing on you or they uh i feel like some sort of help is coming this is maybe you have an admirer here with the page of cups or you just have somebody here that wants to help you somebody is coming to help you i i don't know i don't know who it is but it, this is somebody that is going to be expressing their feelings they're gonna i don't know if you're falling in love with somebody or what you do have some emotional support here i see you connecting with somebody on a very deep level um i feel like this person is going to to help you um, get out of a situation in some way maybe it's maybe it's just helps you to get out of that mindset that you're not good enough as somebody here it really feels like they are not good enough and they're they're feeling vulnerable or weak or inadequate because of another person that put them down you know that told them that they weren't good enough or made them feel maybe it's even a narcissist from the past i don't know but i feel like there is some sort of love here somebody is going to be healing they're going to be helping you to heal from this behavior um an obstacle is being removed i feel like you've been in a place of fear um and i feel like it's at, i feel like it's it's a there's a reason to be in that place unfortunately i feel like you're in a place of fear because somebody um caused you a lot of emotional turmoil um and I, but i do feel like this month you are probably going to be receiving some help okay from somebody um, you may need to accept it though it may be hard for you to accept help okay somebody you know is probably coming to you with with some information or love or support and you may you may be wanting to push them away to protect yourself you know because you you don't trust them whatever i feel like you need to let this person in I feel like there is definitely sorrow over a loss you are going to meet and you're going to need to it let this person in, whoever this person is. I feel like your drama queen, whoever this drama queen is, is uh, they're unhappy. Maybe they're unhappy about the relationship. Maybe, I don't know if it's your person's ex or whatever. Somebody is definitely unhappy about... Uh, your newfound love if you if or your newfound partnership whatever it is they are you definitely have love around you you have emotional support you have a a new start in love here that uh, is going to help you to heal you're healing from something you are going to this person's going to help you to heal Four of Wands, engagement, commitment, marriage, maybe in the future. This is in the future position. Some of you may be even getting a proposal from somebody. This is right next to the Page of Cups. You may be getting a proposal or you, you some of you could be, if you have not met this person yet, you could go to a get together or a party, you know, and meet somebody unexpectedly. This is also unexpected fortune. I, it is. I do believe that you are going to be getting together with somebody um maybe you're going to be flirting with somebody that you don't expect you need to remove that fear you need to open yourself up there's some sort of soulmate connection here okay just saying there is a soulmate connection here absolutely I feel like there's a need to express, there's a need to express your feelings, there's a message of love with the with the page of cups that is a, that is a welcome message of love. Open your heart, follow your heart, open yourself up. Stop holding on to the past. I feel like some of you are um you need to commit yourself to a new path. It's time to build a new foundation. Some of you are going to be deepening a bond with somebody, okay? Despite the drama. You definitely have a drama queen here. There's no doubt about it. You're going to need to master your emotions. Do not lose your temper. You may, you may have lost your temper in the past. Do not lose your temper. Master your emotions. 
accept this person's help it's almost like this person is coming to help you in some way and you fall in love with them or they fall in love with you or something like that or both what well, looks like it's both to me um this is a healing love but what is this speeding causes accidents There's tears over a loss. What is this speeding causes accidents? Five of Wands reversed. That is letting go. Because this is the this is like the tug of war, right? It's letting go. Uh, we have a competition. The end of a game, the end of a battle, giving up. It could also be all out war, five of wands. It could be a serious battle. Speeding causes accidents. There's no need to compete. And you are definitely competing with somebody. There's a competition here. The queen of wands versus the queen of cups. So there is some, there's no need, don't fight, don't, and that's, the five of wands is a fight, don't fight, don't fight, but let's keep going, just whatever, let them win, let them think they won, but what is this speeding, it causes accidents, there's no need to compete, do not compete, and I know you're highly competitive, aren't you, maybe you need to go slower, five of wands reversed. Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles is about self. It's about self-worth. It's about focus on yourself. Focus on yourself right now. You're very capable of success on your own. Graceful. Be graceful. Go slow. There's a reason that you need to go slow. You need to focus on yourself. Let this play out. Let this play out. There's also somebody here that is very, very abundant. This is a hard worker. This is a business. Somebody that, somebody is very capable of having their own business, of being an, this is like an entrepreneur, of starting their own business, of doing their own thing. But you have to go slow. Don't speed into things. Don't worry about the competition. Do your own thing. If you go too fast, it will cause problems. Focus on yourself. Just enjoy this time. Enjoy your time alone. If you're alone, you aren't going to be alone much longer. Don't worry about the competition. Just do your own thing. If you go in a hurry, if you move fast, you're going to make mistakes. And this drama queen is going to point out your mistakes, just saying. You are very capable of success. And you are going to be successful. Some of you are too worried about the competition. Don't fight with this drama queen. Do not. Don't waste your time. All it's going to do is cause more challenges for you. It's going to overwhelm you. Focus on yourself. Focus on this new love or whoever it is. It feels like there's new love here. Maybe it's their ex or it's your ex. There is somebody here that is causing you pet plant challenges. This could also have to do, for some of you, if you, you know, maybe some of you, I don't know if there's an accident, I hate to say that, you know, that somebody was speeding, they were going too fast, and it causes challenges. You will overcome these challenges. Whoever it is, uh, I think there's some sort of trouble. Six of Swords, Reverse, you have a troublemaker here. You're in, you're in a situation where... Um, you really need to move on. You need to leave the trouble behind. This is, a, this is refusing to take a new approach. Um, then that card before that is the five of swords that is fighting a hostile situation. Don't fight. If you want peace and harmony in your life, do not compete. Let them win.
you know, I learned that in a class when I worked for corporate America. It said how to deal. It was a it was a class that I had to take. It was a course actually, how to deal with difficult people. That was the name of the course. How to deal with difficult people. Police officers were in there and stuff too. And uh, the main thing I got from that class was to let the person think that they won. Do not argue with them. Just let them think. Just just agree with them. In fact, you are the winner. Anyhow, um, I feel like this month you are going to get some sort of help. Help is arriving. This is a healing love. You're going to be receiving messages of love or at least a message of love. There is an obstacle that is going to be removed. Um, I think that you need to remove that obstacle. Maybe it's fear. I feel like there is also uh, a drama queen around you that is going to really bring about some challenges. If you want to engage with the battle, if you want to engage with the fight, if you want war, well, that's up to you. The choice is yours. Um, if I was you, I'd focus on yourself and this love, this love that you have in right in front of you. Good luck.